Well, here we are waiting at the Nanaimo Ferry. Got here an hour before the sailing. There was no reservations to be had. And we're waiting for the next sailing. But we should get on that, 125. We'll be in Squamish in time to check in by four, I guess. We made the uh, 125. And interestingly, there's a coastal class sitting there. Probably could have taken all of us. We could have been on the 10. As you can see it's five star. It's uh, got a bed, table for two, a TV, look at that, and then a kitchenette. Oh, I'm standing in the way. Yeah, everything you need. got back from a quick run. It was actually a sightseeing run because there's so many cool things to see here in Squamish. As you can tell, the chief, and, uh, the main drag with uh, Garibaldi there in the background. Pretty amazing. Well, we're going to go in, have some breakfast, and we're going to head up to Blackcomb. Well, here we are, the uh, resort boundary, and everything's closed beyond that into the park. So we're not going to go further. We're going to be respectable, like uh, you know, good tourists should be. But still, pretty amazing. I think that's Blackcomb right there, and there's the views. We're going to find a spot to sit down, and have some lunch, then head back and head over peak to peak to Whistler. Well, after most of the day at Blackcomb and Whistler, 
decided to drive on up to Pemberton. It's pretty much about what I expected. You know, some mountains, dusty little valley, and uh, the rest of the town. And then you look at that view and you think, yeah, I can see why this is a destination. made it out of Squamish, no problem. We're uh, now at Stanley Park, about to hit the aquarium. It's pretty beautiful here.